car crash killed an 81-year-old Colville woman and injured two other people this afternoon. State Route 395 was blocked for several hours near Colville as the Washington State Patrol investigated. It's a developing story Kyle Simchuk has been following. He spoke to troopers at the scene as they pieced together what happened. Kyle. Well, troopers tell us Shirley Ashbaugh of Colville died in that crash. They say she tried to avoid a 24-year-old driver who crossed the center line. Debris covered the road where the two cars hit head-on. Troopers tell us there were three people in that car that drifted into oncoming traffic. The 24-year-old driver was taken to a local hospital. His passenger was airlifted to Sacred Heart. A two-year-old child in the car was not injured. The highway was blocked, forcing drivers to take a detour as investigators tried to figure out what led to the crash. Um, at this time, it doesn't appear that alcohol or drugs was a contributing factor to the crash, but that's still under investigation. And WSP says charges are pending. Washington State is in the middle of a campaign called Target Zero. The goal is to have zero traffic deaths by the year 2030. Already this year, 111 people have lost their lives on Washington roads. Aaron. Kyle, thank you.